going on guys welcome back to another episode today we're out here back on the lake we got the rain suit on because i'm pretty sure we're gonna need it today it's rainy conditions real cloudy it's just misting right now but uh real cloudy misting high winds and that means spinner bait so we're gonna get out there i got a spinner bait tied up we're gonna go out there try to catch some more school and fish fish shallow mainly Fish the windblown banks like I was talking about in the last video and see if we can't get them on the spinner bait. If not, we'll go uh, try to catch them somewhere else on something different. But let's get out there and see if we can catch any. Oh, that one. Oh crap, did I lose him? Or did I just have grass? I, there's not a fish. Dang it, I lost him. Crap. Dang it. Oh, like a nice one too. Back up. Dang it. Dang it. Oh, got one. I didn't even think that was a fish. He's running at me or something. Oh yeah, he's running straight at me. Nice one too. Get up here. Oh dang, that's a yellow one or he got him on the old uh dang he choked it. Okay, so when they eat it like that, you know they want it real bad. The pliers out. Choked it boys. Choked it. Yeah, nice one again. Nice one. Stop flopping. Dang it, you're hanging the dang thing. Really, really, Timothy. I don't know your name is. I must get you, bud. Okay, there you go, bud. Oh, rip my guy. Rip my guy. Hey, 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 brother, brother. Brother, brother, brother. Slow down. Slow down. Slow down. Why can't... Open your mouth! Nice one right there. Get this guy back in the water before we run up on the bank. There you go, bud. No, we just gotta get away from the bank before we run up on the bank and I have to get out in the freezing cold water. Dang, I don't know why that guy was bleeding so much. I mean, I hooked him literally that far in his mouth. What was that? Something just nailed me in the side of the face. We're gonna fish back over here on this one blown bank again. That was on the Strike King Red Eye Shad that we were catching him in the last video. But we're gonna try to fish this area again and see if we can get some more. Got one. Oh, that's a nice one. If that's even a fish. Dang. I don't think it's a fish. Maybe it is. No, it's not. Big tree, boys. Big tree. Got it. I, I, I mean, that's like quick catch and release on that big old tree right there. Quick catch and release. That's how you got good. Oh, I got a little guy. On the old Cinco, getting it done, boys. Getting it done. Little tiny guy, tiny, tiny guy. But he counts. Ah, come on. I'm sorry, my guy. There you go, get that guy. 
Nice little, little nice little wee guy, wee guy right there. Get, get that guy up in the water. There we go. That was just on the little, the Gary Almoto, Watermelon Red, Cinco right there. Texas rig pegged. Just with a little three ounce weight on it. Nothing too special. Get that guy rigged up again. And we'll see if we can catch any more on it. All I saw that time was my line just start running. And I was like, oh yeah, I got one. It was a little one, but he still counts. So we'll see if we can get some more on the old Cinco. I don't know how good y'all can hear me right now, but I'm gonna go to a new spot. spot because it's really windy here. Please work. Oh yeah, we're good. Too windy for this little boat. We're gonna try to make it back across the lake and see if we can find a little calmer spot. Try to fish there. See if we can catch some fish where it's a little calmer. It's getting too rough out here. Starting to rain a little harder, but we're gonna go in and see if we can find a better spot to fish. So, made it back up to the house. Just got done fishing. It got it's calmed down a little but there's a rain, rain headed this way from over there, so we're gonna, um, I came up, got all the stuff came up, but caught one on the Cinco today. Small one, but he counts. That's the most important thing. And uh, one on the little Strike King Red Eye Shad that we've been catching them on. But um, leave a comment down below what you've been catching them on. Maybe it'll help me out. Maybe I can look down in the comments and see pick some baits out that I would like to throw and see if they'll actually work down here. Um, I wanted to use a spinner bait today, but I tried it, but it didn't work. I just have confidence in that uh, little rail trap uh, lipless crankbait thing. But uh, if you're just out there, just go with what you're confident with. If you're confident with the spinner bait, throw the spinner bait. If you're confident with the Senko, throw the Senko. If you're, whatever you're confident, just throw that. But if there's a day where you're just catching tons, like 20 plus fish, just like one after the other, then you need to try something out of your comfort zone. Like for me, that would be something like drop shotting. We don't do that down here in Texas. But if I were to just be catching a ton on one day, I would might try that and see if I'd catch anything on it. But as always, like, subscribe, and we'll see you next time.